Hello, fellow Daz Studio enthusiasts. This is Not From This World, and I want to welcome you to my tutorial. Today, I want to give you some more information about the problems with the newest Daz Studio update, uh, 4.22.0.16. It appears that there may be a couple issues that are causing your computer to crash when you're using DAS or to run really slow or to just not render and a bunch of weird things have been going on. Uh, the first problem could be your NVIDIA card. I have been reading that with NVIDIA, we have had some issues with the latest update. So what I heard was if you have updated your drivers you may want to uninstall them and then reinstall them. And some people have said that's fixed their problem. So you can see I, um, I have not done anything with my drivers yet. I'm a little afraid to do it. I've got some projects I'm working on and I just don't have time for DAS Studio to be failing on me. But if you have recently uploaded new drivers you may want to uninstall them and then reinstall them that could be the issue the other issue may be and probably more likely is probably a plug-in and so i i have gotten information through the forum that if you go to this script you can use a script to disable all of your plugins and i will leave a link to this in the information tab for you. But if you disable all of your plugins using this script, you can then go to help about installed plugins, open that up, and all of your plugins will be disabled. And it looks like Daz needs some help with people enabling their scripts one at a time and running DAS to see if it'll work. Now, what I've been told is if we disable all the scripts, DAS is running just fine. So what that tells us is that one of our scripts is causing the problem with the new update. So this sounds kind of tedious, but users that can follow this and enable scripts one at a time to see if DAS Studio works, we can narrow down this problem and then hopefully someone will discover that it is a certain script and we can get it posted and get a patch made for it. So that's all I have right now about this. I'm kind of surprised that we don't have more information a day or two later, but as of right now, we still don't know what's causing these issues. So if you have the time to play with your plugins, you may be the one to discover what's wrong. So, hey, I hope this helped. I will update again as soon as I have information. I will post another video. Hopefully my next video will be explaining how to fix any issues that you're having with this update. Until then, don't forget to like, subscribe, and shoot me a comment or two. I'd love to hear what you have to say.